Distillation We know that different methods are used for separation of different kinds of mixtures. But do you know how a mixture of two miscible liquids can be separated? Well, such a mixture can be separated by a method called distillation. Distillation is the process of separating miscible components of a mixture that do not decompose upon boiling and have sufficient difference in their boiling points. The process involves heating the liquid until boiling and then capturing and cooling the resultant vapors. The separation of liquids is usually achieved at their respective boiling points. The more volatile component vaporizes at its boiling point and then condenses in the condenser while the other component is left behind in the distillation flask. Thus, separation of the mixture is achieved. Can you separate a mixture of acetone and water? Yes, it can be achieved by distillation. Let us have a look at the procedure of separation using distillation method. Firstly, take the mixture in a distillation flask fitted with a thermometer. Observe carefully how the apparatus is arranged. Then, heat the mixture slowly, keeping a close watch at the thermometer. See the acetone vaporizing and then condensing in the condenser. This acetone can now be collected from the condenser outlet. On the other hand, the water is left behind in the distillation flask. Do you know there are several important applications of distillation? Let us discuss a few important ones. Distillation is employed in food processing to produce distilled beverages. Large-scale industrial distillation is widely used in petroleum refineries, petrochemical and natural gas processing plants. Production of essential oils and herbal distillate is carried out by steam distillation. In addition to these applications, distillation is also used to separate the mixture of ether and toluene and the mixture of hexane and toluene. 